All right, here we are, October 30th, Wednesday. You're looking at my top step dashboard with my combines. This is my lead combine with $52,000, so basically $1,000 away from passing. So not too bad. Hopefully this can get done in the next uh, 10 days as my rebuild. I got a rebuild notice for 10 days out. But at the same time, if it doesn't, all good. I'm not going to force it, but I should be able to. It's only five trades away at $200 or more, um, so it shouldn't, shouldn't be too hard to do that. And then the other combines will trail along and slowly get passed as well. They're, you know, one of them's close to this one. The other ones are a bit farther away. Down in the bottom, bottom of the screen, once I get into Top Step X, you'll be able to see where all those other combines are at. But uh, yeah, not too bad. Um, nine days of trading so far, 67% winning days. Um, and, you know, basically nice boost, grinding away, a little boost yesterday. And we'll just keep grinding and then, you know, we'll boost when we can. When the market conditions are right, we'll get a boost in there. And then when it's not, we'll just be grinding. All right, traders, let's get into today's trades. And hopefully we can uh, continue growing the combines. Okay, get ready to jump into gold long right now in 10 seconds. I'm a little late to the party here, but four seconds. Order filled. Okay, and gold long. All right, gold boosty boosty. Let's do it. Give me 400. Only risk is this uh, resistance area right here. Right there. It's kind of an area, but we can see if it can break out of that and get up to my target. It's a bit of a counter trend trade. Gold has been on the way down over the evening right here. One thing that looks really good about gold right now is this nice cup right here. All right, peak hitting the peaks right here. A little bit of resistance there. As there was before, there is again. Next time we'll see a little bit of that, probably be right in this peak here, which would be pretty much right at the target. Question is, do I take it off a little bit short of the target, just in case this causes a bigger rejection? Okay, starting to get stuck right here. All right, now we're trying to get through. Might start looking to capture this trade here. And I blinked. I would have dropped it in when it did that. Almost my target. All right, peeking in right where it was before, breaking above, in my target. Order. All right, I take that trade off the table. If it wanted to boost right through there, I'll squeeze some more out. But let's go back to the five-minute candle. So I got my target right here. Could be breaking out, going higher, but my target is my target, and uh, the way it's been acting in here, I mean, it's looking strong, but. I'd hate to be greedy and give back and give back a winner when I need these winners to pay for losers. So that's going to bring my my uh, lead account, my top ones, to uh, $52,472 and then uh, 52282 on that other one. So those are pretty good. Uh, basically, I'm three trades away from passing my first combine, maybe four trades from the second combine. And then, uh, you know, I'm, at least I got... We got more than a thousand dollars to go basically for the rest of them i don't know these down here only need 1500 roughly so pretty good if i can get these two passed in the next 10 days then i'll i'll get them done before I rebuild and i won't have to pay again which would be nice you know it doesn't have to happen that way it's fine if it takes longer than that but ideally it happens before that look at gold starting to break out here um if i stayed in gold like probably there's a potential that i could have passed these combines today but i, I don't want to get greedy I don't want to overstay my welcome because just the market, you never know. I had a proven statistical probability for this move. Everything after is a casino trade. So for somebody else to take. But all right, looking good. We'll see if uh, Bitcoin wants to set up later. I don't trade Bitcoin until after 11 o'clock. So I'm going to shut this down for now and go jump over to my live account. Get ready for market open. Let's see if I can make some money over there. All right, everybody. See you on the next trade. All right, so just jumped into Bitcoin short with one contract. I'd like to get two contracts in here, I think. Let me double check that. Yep, I'm going to jump in with another contract short Order filled. as we get closer to risk here. So now I got two contracts in Bitcoin short. We'll see what happens with this trade. Bitcoin is kind of a little bit on a down. Uh, man, on the big picture, looks like it's consolidating. But we are making... A little bit of a consolidation move to a to a down move. Now we came back up into a resistance area, rejected off that resistance area, and basically looking for it to come back down and retest down here somewhere, maybe even make a new low. Question is, will I get stopped out first? 
This is a kind of a big red candle here. You got 17 seconds left before this five minute candle closes. So it should be all right. Retraced half of it roughly. And that's when I added to my position. And then uh, if we break above that candle, of course, it looks like it could be going higher. My stop is just, just shy of that. I should put my stop up here, but this is where my system's telling me to put it. So that's where it's at. And again, this may just be retracing this uh, candle, but we'll be out looking for a new trade tomorrow. All good. It's not so bad when you're taking a loss of like 50 or 60 bucks and you're winning 100 or more. It's pretty nice like that. Order filled. All right, there you go. It's taking a loss in Bitcoin. Not a big deal. Tiny loss. Okay, and back in the office, you can see that Bitcoin trade right here. Like I said, could just be retracing this red candle. I'm probably going to get stopped out on it. And uh, a better stop position would be up here um, so that it had room to do that retracement. But jumped out based on the rules. And now it looks like Bitcoin is getting ready to break down. Um, so I think I'm going to jump back in this trade. We got a little bit more time in the market. Probably won't get a full hit all the way down here. But... Um, may get a little bit recover a tiny bit of bitcoin money so i'm going to go ahead and sell too right on the support level still looks uh, like a trade that's going down though Order filled. so i just jumped in with two contracts for bitcoin and we'll see if we get a little little uh, little bit of money here maybe 30 bucks 40 bucks um somewhere in that area all right i'll bring the conclusion to you all right, here we go. $81, $90. All right, stopped out of Bitcoin right there. Probably should have went long on that trade, huh? So it gave a little more back. Still finishing the day nicely, though. Uh, 52319 in the in the lead account right there. Look at Bitcoin go. What is happening right now? It's a pretty big move for Bitcoin. Yeah, long play would have been sweet right there. All right, but either way, we're doing good. We got, uh, I don't know, maybe five days left. Um, five five days, making a little more than 100 bucks a day. And uh, I'll pass this uh, top combine right there. Um, be good to go. Um, or just a few days of 200 bucks, we'll pass this top combine. And then the, follow, the second one should follow shortly after and then down the line from there. All right, everybody. See you tomorrow.